That's to me. That's my cousin, it's my brother, my uncle, and my other cousin. We were right, it's right there. We used to have barbecues, to have like a seafood crab fest at like different neighbors' houses and things. Hello, beautiful people. I'm Ronique from Washington, D.C. And I was at New Victory Theater where I performed with Step Africa, Migration, the Reflections of Jake Lawrence, and Drum Poet. go with my father every day, every time. All the time when he would get his hair cut, I would go with him. None of this was here. I mean, I, yeah. It's a good thing that, you know, DC is changing. It is. Can you show us where you grew up? This is where I was born and raised in, this house right here. This is my great aunt's house. Um, she passed away and gave the house to my parents um, for rent. But her spirit still lived on in the house. My parents said that it was haunted. I believe that. <laughs> my room was um, next to the hallway where at nighttime it was super dark and I always felt like someone was there. Um, and even at a younger age, I was, I was in tune with what that meant. My grandmother used to live right here. The house was painted, is painted white now, but back then it used to be white. Everyone on this block looked out for each other. My grandma, of course, lived here, so she knew everybody on this strip. So whatever they needed, they came to her. Whenever, whatever she needed, she went to them, and that's the reason why. But even when we moved out, we still came over here. We still came in this area because this is where our community started. I really, I really appreciate how DC has definitely evolved over the years. What do you do when you're not working or dancing? So normally what I do when I'm not dancing, I'm either going to the gym, I'm writing or reading or just finding some self-care or spending time with my parents. So before I usually go to work, I just visit them just to check on them and see if they're all right. So. journey. Um, actually, my mom's daycare. My mom had before and after care kids here. Every song that was out in that era, like NSYNC, Backstreet Boys, Aaliyah, TLC, every album that I had in my possession, I would just find a song from the CD and tell the kids, hey, let's make a dance. And <laughs> I didn't know I was a choreographer until my mother informed me that what I was doing, I was a choreographer. So when she started off, she was two and she never looked back. She was determined that whenever she puts her mind to something, she was gonna continue to soar and complete it. And yeah, it took off after that. I just, I loved how it made me feel. And um, yeah, I'm still doing it. I'm excited, yay. 